This colorful view from a NASA climate model reveals the global impact of smoke from fires. Starting in South America, computer-modeled winds carry green-colored smoke plumes far into the Atlantic. This mixture of organic and black carbon nearly meets another smoke cloud wafting from southern Africa. The dry season there sees many fires, which farmers ignite to clear fields for new crops. Similar fires burn through northeast India. Thick smoke rising from fields gets trapped by the massive Himalayas. Next, we visit the island nation of Indonesia. Unusually large, human-set fires spread haze throughout the region, impacting air quality and visibility. In Australia, wildfires ignited mostly by lightning strikes rage along the eastern and southern coasts. In the southeast corner, giant smoke plumes rise from blazing brush fires. The smoke gets sucked into the constant flow of storms swirling around Antarctica. These storms whip up sea salts near the ocean's surface, seen here as blue spirals that dance about the icy continent. Just in time for a spectacular volcanic eruption, we return to Africa. The continent is home to 70% of the world's fires. Here, smoke from agricultural burning merges with red dust blowing off the Sahara and travels across the Atlantic. Following the smoke on its westward journey, we focus once again on the Americas. Fires are common during the dry season in Central America and Southern Mexico. In North America, fires are relatively rare. Most satellite observations come from agricultural fires in the Southeast and the Mississippi River Valley. As we continue West, long green plumes stretching across the Pacific hint at ferocious fires in Southeast Asia. The smoke extends thousands of miles reaching faraway lands, a reminder of how regional events can have global consequences. Earth is indeed a planet on fire.